Marilyn Emerson has had a love for birds ever since she was a little girl. You'd go out in the woods and you wouldn't see anything, or you'd be in the yard and you wouldn't see anything, but feeding them brought them in close and more stationary, so you had a chance to uh, figure out what they were and to see them. Seeing these feathered friends up close and personal puts a smile on her face. I th yeah, I really enjoyed that, to see the different species that would come in and use these feeders. Having around 20 bird feeders herself, you may say her backyard is a bird buffet. Uh, chickadees are probably the most common. Um, blue jays, uh, white-breasted nuthatches are pretty common. And if you're going to feed these birds all winter, you better stock up on black sunflower seeds. If you're going to feed, that's probably the best seed to use. It's small, so a lot of different birds can use it, and it's easy for them to break open. So if you plan to feed birds this winter, remember... The more birds, the more seed you're going to go through. And no, it can get messy. So I guess if you're going to do it, make sure that you're aware of that and put this, the feeders where you know, maybe it's a little easier to clean up. Reporting from Little Falls, Alex Swikowski, WJON News.